In October of 2009, British Airways launched the unique route titled Club World London City, offering a business class only configuration of the Airbus A318. While the service is certainly unique, it isn't flawless due to aircraft range limitations and in order to land as a domestic flight in New York, the aircraft touches down not long after departure from London City in Shannon Island, clears US customs, fills up its fuel tank and then departs once again. Given that few customers have lined up to order the Airbus A318 since its introduction and there have been no deliveries made since 2013, it has become a unique opportunity to fill the aircraft gap for British Airways' service. Showing off one aircraft the Bombardier CS100 could certainly help serve of this unique route for several reasons. One reason is the completed testing in London. Canadian aircraft manufacturer Bombardier has successfully completed their first non-stop transatlantic flight with the CS100, which was released last year. The aircraft had been at London City Airport conducting steep approaches in order to get its steep approach certification from Transport Canada and EASA. The test flights were successful and the company is expecting to receive this new certification in the second quarter of the year. Bombardier already has extensive experience operating into London City Airport, which is a common place to spot the company's Q400 dual turboprop aircraft, as well as the Challenger 650 and Global 5000 and 6000 business jets. Another reason would be through the presence of Titan Airways. British Airways originally operated the Club World London City service on a twice daily basis, but as time has gone on and demand has weakened, British Airways opted to reduce service down to just one flight per day. Since reducing service, British Airways also leased one of its A318s to Titan who will be operating the aircraft for two years with an option to buy at the end and will be keeping the all premium 32 seat aircraft for the first seven to nine months until the aircraft is reconfigured into a 112 seater economy only layout. Titan had approached British Airways after they had elected to reduce the service to one flight, inquiring on whether or not there would be a potential wind down. With no official comment from the airline or its owner IAG in regards to the future of the service and the aircraft, it is all just speculation and opinions at this time. In opinion, we are likely to see British Airways opt for the CS100 in the future, as it will allow them to remain more competitive for this route, as while they are currently the only airline that operates the London City Airport to New York route, this will soon change. An airline called Odyssey Airlines has already confirmed the order for the CS100 and is currently advertising direct flights from London City to New York which are due to begin this year. A final reason would be the comparison between a new aircraft versus dropped route perspective. With the CS100 having the ability to carry an all premium cabin layout of 40 seats, it would be a unique opportunity for British Airways to have it replace the Airbus A318-100 that currently operates the London City to New York route. While the A318 does not have the range to make the flight directly with its stop at Shannon Airport in Ireland, the CS100 will be able to land in New York without stopping, assuming it can find a way to have its passengers clear customs in the UK or just in the United States as most international flights do. With the CS100 offering 8 more seats than the A318, it is unlikely that this aircraft has a long future left ahead of it for this route. With Britain leaving the European Union, avoiding the stop at Shannon is something that British Airways may opt to do, as with the free movement of people potentially becoming a thing of the past, the passenger would not only need to clear the US immigration stands, but would also now need to clear the EU immigration checks. All in all, British Airways would not appear to have much in the way of a choice with their aircraft selection. However, the CS100 has marked a new moment for all premium transatlantic flights and could serve the airline well if it continues to offer its unique service from London City to New York. Thank you. Backtrack,